We're gonna do a little Trader Joe's haul. Yeah, I'm Keith Lee cousin. <laughs> See, one thing about y'all Houston, y'all don't know how to drive. Y'all do not know how to drive. Welcome back. Ah! We back. We back. We back. 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 <laughs> Welcome back to another vlog. Y'all, I'm so excited because your girl is back on the camera. Do you see me? I know I may not look my best. <coughs> Ooh, I don't know what that was. I know I may not look my best, but it's okay because we're gonna clean up a little later. But I did wanna come on here and just do a little intro because I am about to leave out and probably like, I think it's like 9.30, that, that time right there is not right. But I think it's 9.30 in the morning, I wanna say. But my cycle class is today, it's Saturday, and the cycle class start at 10.15. So I'ma leave out, I'm, a, I'm doing work right now, but y'all already, already told y'all what I'ma try to do. You know, ain't no need to talk about the work. We gonna, we gonna make it work around the work, right? So I'ma clock out, I'ma go to my cycle class, I'ma come back. I'm not gonna wash my hair fully because it's not dirty, dirty, but we gonna spruce it up a little bit. And I had to go look at another apartment today. Now this apartment, y'all, I'm not showing y'all because this place I actually might move to. But I do want to go see it. So, yeah. And then I got a lot of other good stuff. Duh, y'all already know we have fun over here. So, I'm excited. Anyway, um, I'm going to try to take y'all to my cycle class without looking awkward with the camera. But I need y'all to see and hear how difficult it be and how they be up there with the tunes. You know, we're going to have to do the little cuts and everything because of YouTube. But, yeah, girl, I'm going to try to give you a little sneak peek because... Your girl be in there sweating, and I ain't been in like two weeks, so yeah. Anyway, I'm hot now. I'll see y'all in a minute. Bye. Tell me if you like it. Oh, hey. <laughs> so y'all, I am gonna put my headphones on. I showed y'all these in my last video. I got them for my birthday, and oh. <laughs> girl, we gonna zone out for the next 30 minutes, I think it is. No, actually less than that. I need to be out the door by 9.55. So let me put a timer on y'all. I really be living my life off of timers nowadays. And I used to joke my mom, hold on, I gotta tell y'all something so funny. Let me just set my timer real quick. <laughs> Matter of fact, we gonna do 9.50. I'm already dressed in a sense. I'm a little ashy, but that ain't gonna take long to put some lotion on. So 9.50 and then give me five minutes to leave out. So I used to joke my mom, I'm gonna say this real quick, y'all, because y'all know I talk too much. Back when we was younger, and I actually texted my sister this uh, not too long ago. I was like, remember how we used to joke our mom about putting timers and everything on a calendar? I don't know if she used the timers. She used the calendar a lot on her phone for everything, y'all. When I tell you everything she used to put on that camera, I'm going on that calendar, we used to be like, oh my gosh, she's so old. Like, why you gotta use the calendar for everything? And girl, look at us. I set a timer for everything. I got everything on the calendar in my phone. Soon as I make an appointment, oh, let me add it to my calendar. Or as soon as something supposed to happen, or I'm supposed to cancel, I don't know, a subscription, anything, y'all, I'm adding it. Let me put that on my calendar. Pay this bill, let me put that on my calendar. Girl, you old, you can't old, you can't old. <laughs> oh yeah, and y'all, please remind me before I move to put a work order in for that blind. Because girl, I think they do it for free. Y'all don't have to let me know, I don't know. But I think they do it for free. So if they do, I need to make sure before I move, cause I'm not paying for that. Anyway, y'all, <laughs> it's time to tune out. Let's put one of my favorite songs on right now. It's so loud and just get you amped up, y'all. But this is my song. Hold on, y'all, let me show y'all, let me show y'all. Headphones on, why ain't connect? Hold on, wait. <laughs> Hold on, baby. These two expensive not to be connecting. What you doing? Yeah. All right, that's it. I don't know why it's not connecting. Oh, there you go. I told y'all I had to put some on my legs because, girl, your girl was ashy, okay? We can't be out here looking crazy with the knees. <laughs> so, I'm trying to think 
if I want to change my socks. Because one thing I can say about spin class, if you go already, you probably know, but you have to have like the right gear on because as you're moving and riding the bike, clothes is lifting up, shoes kind of hurt a little bit on the pedals. So you gotta make sure you got the right shoes on, right clothes on. Oh, I need to shave my legs, y'all. They looking a little crazy. So yeah, I'm trying to think if I wanna um, change my outfit. I don't think so, I think it's fine. Yeah, I think it's fine. But I do might, I might change my socks though. Let me just put some deodorant on. I already put some on, but I'm putting more on. And yeah, y'all, oh, my mom got me this for my birthday too, y'all. I forgot to show y'all that. Usually we know, I told y'all, I don't know if y'all remember, but my family, we grown. So we usually gift each other, you know, like money and stuff out, birthdays and holidays and stuff. But anyway, my mom got me an actual gift this um, birthday. And this is the Dolce and Gabbana light blue. It's so funny, I told her too, because she surprised me. I didn't know she was going to get me this. And um, when I got it, I was laughing. <laughs> because y'all, when I used to be younger, hold on. When I used to be younger, y'all, I used to wear my mom's perfume, wear her clothes and all that, y'all, when I used to go to school. And she never knew because she used to go to work. So this perfume brought back memories because it made me think like, did she know I was stealing her stuff? <laughs> because this was one of the perfumes, y'all, that I used to wear so much in high school when she went to work so anyway random but yeah shout out to my mom anyway y'all let's go i'm also trying to decide y'all is it at home is it at all to wear this thing on my head why about why the light look like it just turned blue hold on let me move y'all what about now i don't know it look weird but yeah i'm trying to figure out if I want to wear this thing on my head, should I put a hat on y'all? I'm laughing because somebody recently told me too that they tired of seeing that Adidas hat. And I say, you know what? You right. Because I do wear that Adidas hat a lot. <laughs> Especially when I'm working out. So I need to get me some more hats for the gym. Um, Cause y'all already know how to hair. It don't last. So hold on. Ciao, ciao, ciao. Y'all that Bryson Tiller album, bomb. I've been listening to that almost every day. So these are the sneakers we gonna wear. These are my old New Balance. The reason why I like these for cycle class is because of the sole. The sole is really thick. <laughs> that's what she said. And um, it's comfortable on the pedals. So that's why I like these. I don't know if I want to change my pants though. I look a little homey. Let me show y'all. <laughs> y'all, I got these leggings that I cut into shorts. I cut these leggings into shorts, but do it look homey though? I don't think it look homey. I ain't trying to look like I don't care about how I look because I do. But at the same time, I mean, it is just the gym, you know? Like, do you got to look all fancy and stuff every time you go to the gym? I don't think so. Half the time, people be going to the gym with big t-shirts on and everything. So, that'd be all right. I'm just trying to really think if I should keep this on my head. Oh, I'm out of breath. I'm hot. I'm sweating. This is how I look, y'all. This is what I'm wearing to the gym. Well, to cycle class. I'm not going to the gym. But this is what your girl got on. How we looking, girl? <laughs> I decided I am going to put the hat on. Give me a second because my hair look crazy. Hold on. Wait a minute. Y'all thought I was finished. When I put that ass tomorrow, y'all thought it was rented. Flexing on these. I'm like, pop out with the spinach. <laughs> y'all ain't about to have me on camera looking all crazy. See, my hair don't look bad, y'all. I just need to remold it. Yeah, we gotta get a new hat, y'all, because this one is worn down to the ground. <laughs> oh, it's all coming apart. If y'all wanna send donations, just let me know. All right, I'll see y'all there. Peace. Well, I might do a little car session with y'all. I don't know, I'm running late, so probably not. Down to Seattle on the weekend.
Baby, let me tell you something. That class took me out. I am tired and I'm hungry, y'all. I have yet to eat. So I'm gonna get me a quick salad from Salad and Go before I go home. I was gonna get my car wash and vacuum my car before I go home, but I'm kind of tired. I'm ready to just get back to the house, wash up, you know, get in shower, do all those things, get my hair together. Oh, let me call them real quick, y'all. Hold on. I want to try to push my time back for my um appointment. Hi, yes, my name is Roshaya. I was calling to see if I can switch my um tour time today from 2 30 to 3 30 if possible okay all right thanks a lot thank you bye okay that was easy and simple hello thank you for choosing our salad and good today my name is amber can i get a name for your order um may i have a custom salad please absolutely what kind of greens would you like on that Mixed greens and spinach, grilled chicken, shaved parmesan, banana peppers. Eight sixty-five for a salad. No, I'm joking. <laughs> it's a salad and a drink, y'all. Hold on, let me put my camera up for a second. I'll be back. Y'all, I do not have time to wait. I'm hungry now. So we're gonna eat a little bit now. You know what I'm saying? Just a little bit, not the whole thing. Mm. Mm-hmm. Now that's what I'm talking about. That's bomb. Y'all, I forgot that I booked this class at Williams Sonoma, which I found out about these free classes that they do from TikTok. <laughs> y'all know TikTok tell you everything. And they do like free cooking classes, y'all. They do all kind of classes, but the girl um, posted a cooking class that she went to and it's free. It's free, girl. You don't gotta pay for nothing, and you get to eat for free. <laughs> so they cook the food, but you, you know, you taste whatever they made. Mm. Hold on. So it's not a cooking class in the sense like you are cooking, but it's still an experience to do something for free, y'all. One thing about me, I'm gonna find out what I can do for free. You know what I'm saying? Or budget friendly. You know, until we where we wanna be. But anyway, I forgot that I booked the class. And y'all know Cinco de Mayo is this weekend. Which I don't really care to like. Y'all, I don't like getting drunk no more. Like, I don't know. I don't really care about Cinco de Mayo, to be honest with y'all. Because it's like, you get lit. You feel good. But the next day, girl, I'll be over it. So, it is like a Cinco de Mayo thing. So, they also are making a margarita, girl. Because I'm, I'm going for the margarita now. I can do a little one-two margarita. But I don't care to get like drunk, you know. So the class is tomorrow, but girl, that thing is at 11 in the morning. I'm like, damn, I forgot I booked the class, but even still, 11 o'clock drinking a margarita? <laughs> That's a little early to be drinking a margarita. So I'm trying to figure out if I wanna go. I mean, it'll be something to do, but I don't wanna just go just to, just to go. Like I wanna make sure I'm actually gonna wanna go, you know? Anyway, I'm talking too much. Mm. Mm-hmm. Mm mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Now that's what I'm talking about. <laughs> we is back on the cam, y'all. I have taken my shower. I sat under the dryer for a little bit. So now I'm about to just curl my hair. And after that, we are gonna leave out to go hit these Houston streets. <laughs> I'm excited about this apartment though. I really think that this is gonna be the one that I'm gonna get, but we shall see and leave it up to God. You feel me? I remember I had to learn how to do my hair, y'all. I did not know how to do my hair for a long time. And then I moved to Houston and I learned how to do my hair because my hairstylist was in Virginia. I mean, I have a hairstylist here now, but now that I actually know how to do my hair, I don't go to her as often, you know? Unless it's time for me to get my relaxing stuff. That's the only time I go to her. Anyway, y'all, I'm not about to talk y'all to death. Wish I could take it back. I need to put some lashes on y'all because my lashes looking a little crazy. I mean, I was thinking about going without lashes, honestly, because I don't need to put them on every single time. But right now, I was definitely giving naked. If you know, you know. <laughs> that's the lash glue we using and I put my hair up for a second 
because I do want to touch my eyebrows up as well. These lashes are So Wispy by Kiss. I think I got these from Walmart or something. I don't know. But I like the ones that come in the pack like this because you get more than one. I was going to put the ones on that I had on the other day. But I don't know where I put them at, y'all. <laughs> I pulled them off my eyes, but I don't know where I put them at. So we're going to cut the lash line really easy. Quick and easy. <laughs> so I like to take and put the end of my comb Y'all, it was so funny when I was over my boo house and I was putting my lashes on. <laughs> he had never seen me actually put my lashes on. And I did exactly what I just showed John. He was like, oh, okay. Putting the comb inside the glue, that's something new. <laughs> Y'all, the things that men don't see, if they ever knew the certain things that we be doing in the house to get ready, they would probably be like, what in the world? Especially shaving. The last minute shaving, girl, if you know, you know. When you up in that shower and you... <laughs> you know, you try to get that good shaving because you probably ain't get a wax in town, but you want to have fun tonight. Yo, those times are hilarious. Men would probably laugh if there was a fly on the wall. Look at that. Ooh! Lay that bad boy on. Lay that bad boy on. You see it? You got to dry, y'all. That be What I be messing up at is when I try to touch it right after I put it on there. The key is to let it dry. You know? If you like it, then you should have put a ring on it. <laughs> Girl with the tattoo. You can't tell me I'm not my own makeup artist. Girl, lashes who? Lash tech who? One thing about me, I will never go and pay nobody to get my lashes. Well, not let me not say never, because when I become, you know, rich and wealthy and, you know, people might start doing my lashes and stuff, they may be. But otherwise, <laughs> baby, we're going to be wearing strips like it ain't no other. <laughs> Girl, I didn't even notice what time it is. Y'all, I will see y'all later. It's almost 2.30. Oh, my gosh. I thought it was 2 o'clock. I need to be out of here by 2.30. I'm gonna catch up with y'all later. I'm gonna show y'all my outfit real quick, real quick, because I just told y'all I'm running behind. I need to hurry up. I'm glad he texted me. Anyway, this is what I'm wearing. I got my sneaks on, my sambas I told y'all about. These little, I don't know, satin kind of shorts. This tank top I got from Target. I got a bra on, y'all. I don't like bras. I hate bras. And then this little bag. So, anyway. All right, y'all, we have made it to Joey's. I came to get some lunch. I did visit the apartment, y'all. I love the apartment. So I think that's where I'm going to move. Um, I didn't update y'all on that, but I did love the apartment, like a lot. I had one concern, which was addressed when I viewed it today. So yeah, my gut is telling me this is where we going. So anyway, that's good news i couldn't show y'all y'all see once i move and everything that series will be coming in a couple months but in the meantime your girl is hungry and y'all know i love me some joey's joey uptown y'all know i love joey so that's where we better go real quick i just parked and yeah i don't know if i'm gonna take my camera because i don't want nobody looking in my face but i will take my phone and try to get some b-roll on my phone so see y'all when i get back Y'all, it has been how many days? 
I think the last time I vlogged was on Saturday. Saturday, y'all. Saturday. So, I went to Joey's. That was the last thing I did. After Joey's, I went to my boo house. And, girl, <laughs> you know, I stayed the night or whatever. So, I did not get back home until Monday. But I had to work. So, today is Wednesday. My day off, technically. I worked a little bit, but... Anyway, I do have a few things I need to do. So I was like, I didn't even close the vlog out. So let me just do it today, you know? So just two things though, not too much. I do want to tell y'all about when I get back to the house about my new budgeting um, little spreadsheet thing that I got from this girl off of TikTok. I got to tell y'all about that later because I really, really like it so far. This is my third month using it. And I meant to tell y'all in my last video when I was talking about paying off debt and stuff but anyway i do want to go to trader joe's i was supposed to do that last week if y'all remember if you watched the last vlog if you didn't then watch it after this <laughs> and i need to also grab me something to eat because i haven't really ate anything yet y'all just some fruit and then earlier i had what i have oh some salmon and some veggies so they have a coupon going on at true food kitchen buy one get one so y'all already know i love me a good deal you already know i love me a good deal so this is what i'm wearing y'all i don't have time to really like move the camera just some baggy jeans um a graphic t-shirt and my sneakers and i am bringing my mark jacobs bag with me because i do have my laptop because yeah girl even though we want to move <laughs> i might gotta you know pause for a second do what i need to do but we're gonna get food first and then we're gonna go to trader joe's anyway i have my trader joe's bag again we're gonna put it in the mark jacobs bag i see y'all in the car or either when i get the true food kitchen bye y'all this new bryson tiller album 10 out of 10 i recommend y'all i love it so much i listen to it almost every single day i feel like i told y'all that before I did tell y'all either in this vlog or the last vlog. One of these vlogs I told y'all about this album. If you like Bryson Tiller and you like that album, what was that album called? Was it Trap Soul? I think it was Trap Soul. And um, yeah, I think that is the name. This remind me of how good that album was. So this one he did really, really good on. I love it so much, y'all. See, one thing about y'all Houston, y'all don't know how to drive. Y'all do not know how to drive. Y'all don't. Either that or I don't have no patience. <laughs> One or the other. And it's giving both. I do not have any patience. Anyway, y'all, I applied for my apartment. Ah! The one that I just went to go see the other day. A couple days ago when I told y'all. I applied for the apartment. I haven't got the confirmation yet. But y'all know how when you apply somewhere and then they start like sending you stuff. Such as like their portal and all that. To me, if that's a sign that I got approved to me. I don't know, I'm, I'm just taking that as a sign. Um, the only thing she says she need to do is verify my um, employment. Yeah, that's the only thing she says she gotta do. But I'm just waiting for the confirmation, you know, just to make sure. But in my gut, it's telling me I got approved. <laughs> so if I did get approved, God's willing, I got a couple more months at my Karen apartment. I feel like I just started to really enjoy my Karen apartment, but it's all good though. I know you're not trying to slide over. Are you trying to slide over with no signal, sir? <laughs> with no signal? Anyway, y'all, I'm gonna finish this to the price until Hold on, I don't know the words yet, but I do like this one, hold on, y'all. Hold up. Did you hear him? He said, Ever since you cut ties with your ex, it ain't been the same price. Okay? Yo, he talking that junk in here. Y'all, we have made it to True Food Kitchen. I'm so excited. My stomach is in my back. And it was just growling too. <laughs> Y'all, one thing about me, if y'all can't tell already, I'm so dramatic. I'm very dramatic. Very dramatic. Okay? But who wants boring? <laughs> Not me. <laughs> Do you? 
last time I came here, y'all, they was like, are you like a food reviewer? And if they ask me that today, I'm gonna be like, yeah, maybe they'll give me something for free. <laughs> Just maybe. Just maybe. Yeah, I'm Keith Lee cousin. <laughs> it feels so good to be out of the house. Woo! It feel good, y'all. It feel real good. I know last time I came here, y'all, I got the Olipop. I remember it was really good. But I don't know if I want that or if I want a little sippy sip, you know? Am I the only one that need to see pictures of their food? Even though you can read it, I need to look at it and see if it's what I want. <laughs> Chicken teriyaki bowl don't look bad. That actually looks good. Rice, zucchini, peas, pineapple, red onions and carrots and asian herb yeah i want to try the um teriyaki remix bowl and then the other one i wanted to go would i order that now or later the other one i'm going to think more on oh, think more? yes yeah, no worries. did you but, want any protein for the teriyaki yes yeah, chicken for that one yes do anything you want me to y'all have to learn how to love yourself enough and feel comfortable in your own body enough to be able to go out by yourself and not care about what other people think okay cheers to that all right y'all let's give it a try this looks good it looks good it looks good it's good yep this is a pineapple spritzer, so it's not alcohol. This is really good. This looks so good, y'all. It's very different, but it looks good. Mmm. Yeah, baby. Y'all, we are right in the front, just the way I like it. I'm gonna leave my camera, what's my phone on? Yeah, I'm gonna leave my camera in here, and then I'm gonna vlog off of my phone. Is nothing but cakes open? I got a birthday reward that I have not redeemed. I think they closed, but why they closed? Let me see, cause I think they closed, but I don't think they should be closed. They are closed, but they supposed to close at nine. I'm lying. <laughs> Why am I lying? It definitely says seven. <laughs> hey, y'all, it definitely says seven. Anyway, I'm going to take my Trader Joe's bag. I'm going to vlog on my phone. This should be a quick in and out. And I will show you guys everything when I get to the crib. Okay? Okay. See you later. Y'all, I had to carry so many bags up. It was ridiculous. We're gonna do a little Trader Joe's haul. Even though I feel like I showed y'all everything from me grabbing it, but I'm gonna show y'all again anyway, just in case you missed it. Just in case you missed it. So, I did try some new stuff. I'm excited. I'm excited. Y'all know how I am. Y'all know when I try new stuff, I wanna eat it right now. But I can't, I can't do that with everything because it's gonna be too many different flavors, you know? But the first new thing I'm trying is white cheddar corn puffs. Now, I just recently ordered some popcorn from Double Good Popcorn, y'all. Oh my gosh, y'all. That popcorn so daggone good. It's ridiculous. But shout out to my aunt, because <laughs> she put me on. Y'all already know I got to shout out to people who put me on. Shout out to my aunt. She put me on. I think it's called Double Good, if I'm not mistaken. It came the other day. I got the white cheddar one, and then I got the caramel cheesy one. Y'all, the caramel cheesy one, the bag is almost gone. So, I'm excited to try this. I will have to update y'all 
I guess, in the next vlog on what this tastes like. I think I'm gonna try these right now. These, y'all, I was like, okay, these look a little, a little sus, but I love, 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 love. My favorite ice cream used to be cookies and cream. It's butter pecan now. But cookies and cream used to be my favorite ice cream. I still love it. So when I saw cookies and cream pretzels, now I know I shouldn't be eating these because I'm trying to slim down, you know, but mind your business, you know, sometimes you just gotta, you just gotta try some things. So I do want to try these. I did see somebody on TikTok with these as well. So I already know these about to be bomb. So let's, <laughs> y'all already know, I'm be honest. Cheers. Oh my gosh. Yo. Oh my goodness. I feel like I spit them. Why did I buy these? Why did I buy these pretzels? Why y'all let me buy these pretzels? <coughs> First of all, y'all cheated me out of my money. All of this could have been filled up. Y'all, these are so good. Oh my goodness, these are dangerous. Mmm. Mmm. Oh my gosh. Oh my god. Oh my gosh. Bomb. 20 out of 10. They bomb. Damn, they good. <laughs> I want another one. I did get my steel cut oats. I got two this time because it only come two in a pack, girl. Two in a pack. That's it. So. I love these. These taste so good. I didn't even notice there was brown sugar maple syrup. I did not know that all this time. Are they both that way? Yeah, that's why I like it so much. But anyway, these go in the freezer. You put them in the microwave. I think on like two or three minutes or something. And you don't need to add no sugar or that extra stuff. You don't need none of that. This is good just the way it is. And the serving size is really good as well. This is also something new, y'all, that I saw on TikTok. Now, this is going to mess up my mouth. That taste buds because I got that pretzel in my mouth. But I'm going to have to let y'all know. i probably try these in the morning for y'all. I'm going to extend the vlog until the morning because I love y'all so much and I miss y'all so much. So I'm going to do that for y'all so it can so the vlog can be nice and long. Look at me tripping over my words. Anyway. <laughs> these are soft and juicy mango. I'm excited. Now y'all know the last time I tried some dry mango or dry fruit on here from Trader Joe's, it was disgusting. But I heard good things about these. So I'm gonna try these out. Y'all let me know if y'all try any of these snacks I'm showing y'all, okay? Next thing I got was two of these, y'all. Y'all know how much I love these. These are the chicken breakfast sausage patties, girl. I got two of them. These are so good. I love them for breakfast. So I also saw this. Now I have not seen anybody talk about this or review this, but it's a chicken bowl. It has peppers, chicken, spinach, onions, and creamy garlic sauce with rice. And I think this is going to be really good based off of everything I just listed. It sounds like it's going to be good. So I will have to let y'all know about that. That's something new. And of course, I got my chicken wontons. Y'all, I love these so much. And they are so low in calories. So yeah, eight, eight of these is only 130 calories. Really good. And I found out about these originally from my girl, Aaliyah's face. If y'all know, y'all know. Next thing I got is some coffee creamer. Now, I do not drink coffee as much as I used to. But when I have a taste for coffee, I do want to have it already. So the coffee creamer is brown sugar. Now, I'm going to give y'all a little secret. Come here. Come here. Come here. Come here. <laughs> I'm going to tell y'all something. Shout out to my boo, Miss Jamie, as well, because she watched the vlog, too. But Miss Jamie, me and Miss Jamie was just texting not too long ago, maybe a couple days ago. And she was telling me how she put brown sugar coffee creamer in her matcha. And I was like, oh my goodness, me too. Now, I only tried it like once or twice. I ain't gonna lie. I ain't did it a whole bunch of times because I was just trying things out. But baby, this will come in handy for the coffee. And when I make my matcha, a little, little splash of that. Y'all don't even know. Now, this is dangerous. This is the banana pudding ice cream. I don't know if y'all remember if it was last year. I think it was last year I tried this on camera, girl. This right here, bussing, okay? Bussing. I don't even know why I got this. Lord, why I get this the summertime coming. I just keep buying all these snacks. 
But girl, I could not pass up because this is seasonal, girl. They ain't got this all the time. So you just never know when you got a taste. You want to have it in the freezer already. You know what I'm saying? So anyway, <laughs> y'all know I'm excited. Next thing I got is the maple puffers. Y'all already know how much I love these. These are also not good for me. <laughs> But they are good if you eat it at a what is it eat it in moderation and it'll be just fine so these are bomb i've already tried those they are not new to me finally got some chicken dumplings because y'all love to, to sell these out y'all love selling these out but i i got them today i got them today so i got two of them you know i had to do that and then these just some sweet potato fries i've never tried them but it's something to try. I love the dark chocolate almonds. I had them before, bomb. And then last but not least, y'all, I got a kombucha. I have not seen this flavor in H-E-B in a while, so I decided to pick it up. And that is everything I have, y'all. So, I love y'all so much. I'm gonna talk to y'all tomorrow. L listen, listen up so y'all can remind me. <laughs> I gotta tell y'all about this budgeting app. The reason I'm not gonna tell y'all right now is because I gotta do you know, I got to handle some business on the clock. You know, I'm at the clock in in a minute and I'm going to work till midnight. It's 8.30ish right now. So I'm going to tell y'all tomorrow because I'm extending the vlog about the budgeting app. Make sure y'all remind me about that. And I'm going to tell y'all a review on those mangoes. But it's something else I need to tell y'all. Hold on. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on, wait a minute. Y'all thought I was finished. Oh, they having a coach sale. Now, I might do that in my next vlog, y'all. But hopefully the sale is going on until this weekend. Because I'm going to vlog this weekend as well. And I think I'm going to treat myself to something nice. Because I get a bonus on this check that's dropping tonight. I wish it hurry up. But I get a bonus on this check. So I'm excited. I might treat myself to something from Coach. Y'all know I want my bag, but I'm not gonna get that right now because that's a little too high for me right now. And plus, that's that's being gifted to me, so I'm gonna just wait on that. But I have been looking at other um, bags on Coach site, and I think it's one that I might wanna get that's on sale. But anyway, that'll be this weekend, y'all. We gonna have fun this weekend because <laughs> your girl got a nice check coming tonight. Anyway, y'all, I will see y'all. <laughs> I played too much. I will see y'all in the morning. Peace. The next day. Y'all, I'm so mad because every time I scratch my hair, the color from my hair, which is, I have a black rinse in there, it goes under my nails. And it just looks like my nails are dirty and they're not. But anyway, that's so random. But yes, today is Monday. So I'm about to close the vlog out really quick. But I did promise y'all, two things i told y'all i was going to show y'all the budgeting app that i use and i told y'all i was going to try the mangoes for y'all so i'm gonna try the mangoes first and then we gonna talk about some money some money <laughs> hold on all right we back so these are the mangoes i have not tried them i'm excited though i had to have some patience and discipline oh lord i think this gonna be bad this might be bad y'all this might be bad oh I'm not gonna take a lot. I'm just gonna do a little piece because I'm scared. I'm kind of nervous. Why am I so nervous, y'all? I usually be excited to try stuff. <laughs> not this, okay. Mm-mm. See? Listen, I'm just a person that just like to eat the fruit regular. Baby, all this dry fruit, frozen, dry, soft, juicy, I'm good. This, mm -mm. no. <laughs> Y'all, no. And, and I don't know. Everybody's taste buds is different. The texture is too tough. It's just, to me, a waste of calories. Like, if I'm going to eat fruit, I'm just going to eat the fruit. Like, I'm, I'm done with the dry fruit. I'm not trying no more dry fruit. Don't even recommend it to me. And that's what I get. Keep trying to look at TikTok for every day on thing. So, that is a no. But let's talk about this budget app. So, the app I got, like I said, is a PDF form I downloaded from this girl. I forgot her name. I don't know. I said seeing somebody with a budgeting 
um, template already made on TikTok and it looked like it was easy to use. So I just downloaded it. I think it was like $8.99 or something like that. Super cheap. And the girl ended up being an Aries, y'all. Oh, y'all know I love me some Aries. But I did not know she was Aries when I bought the product. I'm not gonna lie. I just was buying it because I'm like, let me just see. But I ended up going to her Instagram and following her on Instagram and I had saw that she had a birthday and it was on April something. So I was like, oh my goodness, girl, she had Aries. So I have already started using it in the budgeting app. But I'm not going to show y'all my exact numbers. But I'm going to give y'all like a roundabout. Hold on. And another thing I do like about this app is that you can't try to um, like send it to your friends. You're the only one that got access to it. Hold up. Let me make sure I got it. Let me. Let me. Let me. I'm trying to find the original copy. Hmm. Cause I do want the original copy on here. Hold on, y'all. Give me like, give me a couple minutes. I'm gonna see. So this is the original template that came when I signed up. So this is like all the information you need to know. Honestly, y'all, there are a lot of different tabs you can use down here at the bottom, but I don't use any of them. I just use the monthly budgeting one. And so she had it pre-filled, just to different categories already. I changed mine and customized mine to how I want it to be. So mine's have um, May right now instead of monthly budget planner, it says May. But is everything is already set up exactly how you need it to go. It has the categories, it has the budget breakdown right here, where your money going, it kind of give you a glimpse of if you overspend it or whatever, whatever like that. So I like this number right here because every time you enter a number, this adjust so that you know how much you have left. So I just put that as zero. So it should um, update. Okay, so it just went to a thousand. So I'm gonna use this as an example real quick, y'all. Real quick, real quick, real quick. So I like the fact that it has debt payments over here in the corner because Sometimes, you know, you try to justify why you're spending money on whatever you may be spending money on, and sometimes it ain't that. So, for instance, if my check was $3,000, right, and I have rent on here, I don't know, we're going to put rent as $1,200, then you could put, like, lights, you can do that as $65, but you see right here, this number keep adjusting, y'all. So lights, um, let me see, cell bill. This isn't how mine is set up. I'm not gonna show y'all my numbers, but y'all, when I tell you this thing is so helpful, uh, let's do $100, right? And then, I don't know, what else? Water, girl, I can't even think right now. Um, let's do 65, and then let's do car note or something like that. Uh, I don't know, let's do 350. Anyway, you get the point. Now this is the once area. This area is typically categorized for me personally based off of little things that I might wanna do such as like my hair, uh, anytime I need my car repaired, gas, just putting stuff in a cut for when these times come, households. Sometimes I don't even use all the money I set aside for this, but point of the matter is these are all wants. So these can be adjusted how you want. These are needs, obviously. And most of my wants, y'all, is going inside of my book at home that I told y'all about, the little um, budgeting, what is it called? The planner thing I got. And then this down here, obviously, is debt payments. I don't know why they got a car down there. I mean, I guess that's debt, but mine was more so stuff that I should not have been paying on in the first place. But a car, to me, is a need. So, and you can just keep adding on to it. You can delete as you go. You can highlight if you want. I like to highlight mine as I pay it so that I know what I paid. And yeah, y'all. And then they got the savings obviously down here. So with me in this case, it says 720 left. If I want to save 720, I'm like, okay, I got $720 left. This is what I could put aside. I don't know. It's just um something to go by. Now, some people don't need all this, right? This works for me because I'm used to writing everything down and just having it on a spreadsheet like this has been so easy and simple to me and i'm able to see where i'm putting all of my money at and if i'm just spending money just to spend money 
so yeah y'all that's that anyway y'all that is it for this vlog if you like the video give me a thumbs up if you do not like the video give me a thumbs up i appreciate y'all for clicking on that video and i will see you guys in my next vlog peace